It's very cold. It's very, very, very cold. Biggest lake uh, in Mount Kenya. Amal, what do you think? It's beautiful. Yes. Yes. Good morning, guys. So today we are headed to Mount Kenya. We'll drive up to Lake Rutundu. From Lake Rutundu, tomorrow we are hiking to Lake Alice. It's one of the biggest lake around Mount Kenya. What's yeah, inside? morning, guys. Uh, we are going back to Lake Rutundu. Uh, last time we were there, um, we didn't make it to Lake Alice. So to, this time we're going to make sure that we're going to get to Lake Alice. It's just a mere five kilometers from Lake Rotundo. Uh, see you as we proceed. In 2021, we visited Lake Rotundo, which is one of the 25 plus lakes on Mount Kenya and is one of the biggest four lakes of the mountain. At that time, we didn't manage to visit Lake Alice, which sits on top of Mount Itanguni, a mini mountain situated high above Lake Rotundo and Mount Rotundo. We swore to come back and visit Lake Alice and be done away with it. Well, we are making good progress. The still shows that we should be in Nanyuki by around middle, which I believe is ideal for us because uh, we, will, uh, we are planning to get to camp by at least 4 p.m. for a change so that we at least set up before uh, before dark. We are well prepared this time. When you're going to Rotundo, you want to hike all the way to Alice, just make sure you have enough uh, warm clothing with you. Uh, if you can carry a heater, uh, even better. Something about like Alice, uh, where we are going, Lake Alice is the largest uh, Mount Kenya lake. Mount Kenya has several uh, lakes, uh, of which Lake Alice is just one of them. Lake Alice is different from Lake Alice. Uh, lake Rutundo, on the other hand, has very big trunk. So next time you go to Lake Rutundo, carry your fishing rods and get a permit, and go and try your luck in uh, fishing. Catching some trout. Yes. Something also about Lake Rutundo, charge the Rutundo cabins, uh, log cabins which were made famous by yes, yes, the Kate. crown who proposed to his wife Kate Middleton at like Rotundo log cabins. So we'll be camping there. a quick stopover just to stretch our legs before we head out to Manuki. Manuki is just some um, 50 minutes away so we should be there by noon. 
finally made it to Nanyuki. So I've been through the equator crossing at Maseno, I've been through the equator crossing at Meru National Park, and also I've been through the equator crossing now at, Na, now at Nanyuki. So how many equator crossings have you guys passed through? Let me know in the comments. If you have been to Nanyuki, you must stop here. Check this out. Hi guys, so this is Timau. Made a quick stopover just to soak in this beautiful, beautiful view. No cars, no nothing, just silence. Finally made it. Just making our way uh, to the main entrance, Kenya Forest Service Marania Station. Of course, it's quite a bit of a ride uh, all the way to Lake Mutundu, but in terms of getting to the gate, we are going to make payments and just check in. It's, it's, it's here. Then after this, you have like an hours an hours or so drive to Lake Mutundu. down to around 25 Lake Rutundu and Lake Alice are located on the northern side of Mount Kenya and can be accessed from Marania side of Mount Kenya which happens to be one of the least explored sites of Mount Kenya the journey from Marania gate to Lake Rutundu takes you through moorland going up and up through scenic landscapes until you reach Mount Tundu under which Lake Tundu nestles. Both Lake Alice and Lake Rutundu sit in craters of homonymous hills, with Lake Rutundu being the fourth largest lake of Mount Kenya and Lake Alice being the largest of them all. Lake Rutundu is located at an altitude of 3,100 meters and is farthest away from the summit as compared to other lakes. Guys, after a grueling, grueling eight hours or so, finally made it to camp. It's around 6:15 p.m. Uh, slightly later than expected, uh, but good thing we made it. A bit of a car problem, but we made it. Trying to find a place where we can 
set up camp. After setting up and settling down to a hot meal and crackling fire with all stories of romantic escapades of the British royalty at Lake Futundu and of ancient explorers who went to Lake Alice in search of mythological creatures, then the kids enjoyed a movie under the stars. Another morning, another adventure, another mountain. As you guys already know, we camped at Lake Rotundo. The lake is not visible from here, but the idea was just that we set up camp here. Then in the morning, we hike up to Lake Alice. So it's about 6.30 a.m. in the morning. It's very cold. It's very, very, very cold. So we just want to clean up and whatnot, and then just uh, start our hike. At least I believe that will get our bodies warmed up a bit. This is what our camp looks like. So we set off for the hike, making our way slowly to Lake Alice. It's around uh, 10 a.m. in the morning. We hit the trail. This is where we are headed. So Lake Alice is somewhere right over there. So it sort of will be doing some sort of circumnavigation. I'm here with Jibril and Amal. Amal, say hi. hi. Good girl. We have just started our hike. Yes, I hope we'll manage it. Come from over there. If you can see those little cabins over there, that's where Rotundo is. So we've come from all the way. There. We still have quite a bit, quite of a bit of a distance to cover because uh, we, need, we still need to climb this. So my guess is like we are halfway. So we need to go because the lake is right on top. Quick breather, 
we're almost there just up there we're almost there Kadija seems wasted yeah. so yeah looking back at it again But surely we're making our way to the top. It's quite tough, I'm not going to lie. Amal is dead, dead asleep. She doesn't even know the mountain climbing. Yeah. Jib is trying. I strongly believe the lake is somewhere up there. We are not sure, but we'll find out. That's why we are nomads. I actually thought Lekalis would be right ahead of me right now, but shock on me. Shock, shock, shock on me. Ah, oh, seems like we might still have some ground to cover. Because we actually thought the lake would be down here. Okay, I haven't seen the bottom. Let me hope I'm wrong. So, I guess we'll find out shortly. But the view is beautiful. I'm the first one to get here. And we're rolling into real Hamal. We're still coming. Look at the view, guys. It's so beautiful. It's worth every sweat. Ah, I'm so happy we finally made it here. Yes! Yes! It's here! Lekalis! We made it! Woo! We made it! We made it! <laughs> you're not sure? Kadija, what are your thoughts on the hike so far? Uh, how tough was it on a, from, on a scale of 1 to 10? But compared to Ngurumon? Ah, no, 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 no. This is better. <laughs> this is better? Yeah, this is better. Ngurumon was super tough. Yeah, this is exactly three hours. But mm -hmm. I have hiked for three hours. Three but, hours? Yeah. From Ngurumon, we hiked from... Uh, in fact, we started from eight, around eight. Mm -hmm. And we finished at uh, seven. Seven? Yeah, yeah. Must have been a real roller coaster. Yeah, this one. Ah, yeah. I'm so happy. And the lake is big and very beautiful. So, yeah, this yeah. is it. Yeah. Hi. You have made it. Thoughts of on the hike? What are your thoughts on the hike? It was worth it. Uh-huh. It was tough. Uh-huh. But now we are at the biggest lake uh, in Mount Kenya. Uh-huh. Lake Alice. Even though there's no sunshine, but we have made it. So guys, we made it to Lake uh, Alice, which is a uh, uh, to Mount Kenya, it's the largest lake uh, in uh, Mount Kenya. Uh, it's the largest among the 40 something lakes of Mount Kenya. It is really high up. Uh, we started from Rutundu. This time we didn't go to Rutundu like Rutundu. I don't know if you'll pass by. We have been there before. It was a hard trek getting here, but we made it and we were very happy uh, to, to have made it to this place. This lake is like. Um, I think three kilometers round. Uh, that's one kilometer, two kilometer, three. Approximate from my very layman uh, uh, perspective. Uh, it's big, it's big. Lake Alice, I've seen guys running around like uh, Lake Alice, but Lake Alice, no. Yeah. Amal, what do you think of the lake? It's beautiful. Yes. Yes. Lake Alice is named after Princess Alice, who was the Duchess of Gloucester and the wife of the third son of King George V of Great Britain. She tried to climb the Mount Tanguni and access Lake Alice in 1934, but had to give up because of adverse weather conditions.
uh, after spending a few hours here at Likelist, finally leaving back for camp. Hopefully, see if you can make it back to Nairobi today. It's a bit late though, but uh, we'll see. It's a beautiful, beautiful place. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the scenery. We have been to Lekalis. Lekalis is done and dusted. And we are leaving our mark here. Put your hands here. Jibril, and what about your mark? Put your hands here. <laughs> Good girl! Clap for Amal! Yay! <laughs> Let's go, guys! Yeah. yeah. Alright. Done and dusted. Done and dusted. Woo! <laughs> famous Le Crutundu cabins. This is where Prince William and uh, Kate Middleton slept when Prince William proposed uh, to Kate Middleton. Look at this depression. So, so deep. So this is the pulley system that they used to take firewood across then they take them to the cabins it's easier than going all the way around okay, this is